exercise 2.1 question number 1 the graphs of y equal to p of x are given in the figure below for some polynomial p of x find the number of zeros of p of x in each case we will find the number of zeros in the example question in detail data explain the number of zeros is the number of x intercepts find out the number of zeros first question consider this graph x axis is not cross so, number of zeros is equal to 0. Second question, le, one point is cross. Le, so, number of zeros is equal to 1. Third question, le, x axis is considered 1, 2, 3. 3 points is cross. Le, so, number of zeros is equal to 3. Fourth question, le, 1, 2. 2 points is cross. Le, so, number of zeros is equal to 2. Fifth question, le, 1, 2, 3, 4. Now, 4 points le, x axis in graph intersect and or cross and so number of zeros equal to 4. Sixth question le, 1, 2 and 3. So 3 points le, graph x axis in intersect and so here number of zeros equal to 3. For example, question explain we have linear polynomial and quadratic polynomial we have explained it. Now, parabolic shape is like quadratic polynomial. That is the straight line and the linear polynomial. Second question is the number of zeros equal to 1 but the graph is straight line. So it is not linear. That is why we have a constant polynomial graph. Explain. Question number 1 is the constant polynomial. X axis is a parallel line, straight line. That is constant polynomial. Here, P of x is the value constant. This is the positive. Now, the negative constant is the x axis is below parallel line. Graph x axis is a parallel line, that is a constant polynomial. Graph is a straight line, that is a 1 degree polynomial or linear polynomial. Any graph is a parabolic shape, that is a 2 degree or quadratic polynomial.